It's Cindy. Welcome to yoga. We're going to do some seated core work because I need it. It's the COVID-19, like 19 pounds since the COVID crisis. Let's hit the mat. Start up with a quick warm up. We're going to sit cross-legged. We're going to put those hands, palms up, big inhale and exhale. Got to get that breathing tuck in that belly and out. One more, and out. We're gonna take those arms this time all the way up, and down, and up, and down. This time we're gonna take a twist up, twist it down, breathe up, center all the way over, twist it down, exhale, inhale, Twist to the other way, exhale, inhale, twist, exhale, inhale, and back to that center. Beautiful. We're going to put those arm, hands, palms down right on those knees. We're going to take those shoulders, roll them up and back. We're going to tuck in that belly button. We're going to tuck that chin all the way down. Nice and tight. We're going to breathe while we tilt and turn that head side to side. So breathe in. Exhale, roll that head to one side gently. Inhale back to center. All the way down. Exhale at center, pulling those shoulders down away from those ears. Rolling that chin and head on that next inhale. And exhale back to that center. Inhale back straight. Rolling those shoulders back and down. We're going to come to all fours. So come on that mat. You can be on <laughs> those hands or on those fists if that's a little bit easier on those wrists. Hands just below those shoulders, knees just below those hips. We're going to take a big inhale into that cow pose, lift that chin, lift that tail, then we're going to exhale into that cat, angry cat, lift that back all the way up, inhale cow, exhale cat, get those shoulders away from those ears, inhale, pull them down, exhale cat, we're going to do one more and then come back to that center, inhale, and exhale, cat. Inhale this time to that nice neutral position. From here, we are going to work on that bird dog. Tuck those abs nice and tight. Take that right hand, reach it forward. Inhale. And exhale. On the next inhale, we're going to take that back leg, that opposite leg. So if this is your right, you're going to take that left, pushing that heel back at hip level. Inhale, and exhale, looking straight at that ground, reaching apart, hands and feet, reach apart. Inhale, and exhale. One more, inhale, abs tight, exhale, inhale, releasing that hand this time all the way back to the mat, exhale. Inhale, releasing that leg back to that mat. Exhale. Next inhale, it's left hand out. Exhale. Inhale, that right leg, reach with that heel. Exhale. Abs are tight, tail tight, reaching away. Inhale. Exhale, looking straight at that mat. Inhale. Shoulders away from those ears. One more. Next inhale. Exhale that hand back down to the mat. Inhale. Exhale that knee back down to the mat. Right there. That's beautiful. We're going to move into a downward facing dog. We need to put those palms down. Fingers nice and wide. Abs nice and tight. Curl those toes under. And we're reaching up with that tail while we push in with our palms, reaching with our heels, chest comes down, tailbone lifts up to the sky, 
Release that head nice and loose. Keep working into those heels. Keep lifting up that tail. If you need to have those knees bent, by all means, exhale, inhale, and exhale. We're going to come down to that puppy, that puppy pose. We're right here on those knees. Nice back. Pushing out those arms, relaxing. This is great for those shoulders, lifting that tail. You can relax that forehead on that mat. Keep that tail up. It's not all the way back down in child's pose yet. You want to reach those arms forward. You should be feeling that stretch in those underarms. Big inhale. And exhale. One more. And exhale. You're going to curl those toes under and walk yourselves back on to those heels, that nice stretch. If this stretch is not good for you, then you can come down to the side, take that, those shoulders back. Nice big inhale and exhale. We're gonna take those legs, bring them under us this way. Come and sit, we're gonna work into that yoga boat position. We have lots of different levels. We're going to start with those legs out. Nice bend in those knees. We got to tuck in that belly button. That guy's got to pull all the way in and down. So think about reaching that belly button towards that tailbone, back to the spine, down towards your tailbone. You want to roll those shoulders all the way back. And we're going to take our, the top portion of our body and we're going to start leaning backwards. So if you're a beginner, you're going to start and you're going to hold on a little bit right here to lean yourself back. You've got to engage those abs. Pull that guy in. Big inhale and exhale. If you've got that mastered, you can release those arms forward. Inhale and exhale. If you want to step it up, arms come up high. Inhale and exhale. That next step is lifting one leg off the ground. Inhale and exhale. Bringing that guy back down the opposite leg up and down. And if you can, both legs come up off of that ground. You're sort of relaxing, finding that tailbone for balance. You need to put those hands down to find that balance right here and then bring them back. They can always be here. They can stay here for balance, or they can be up here. If you want to make this more intense, straighten those legs. You're in that yoga boat position. Keep those shoulders pulled down away from those ears. Belly button pulled in towards that tailbone. Breathing. One more. Bring those knees in. Knees all the way down. Hands come.